Hello my dear students, I hope you all understood what I taught in the last session. As stated in the previous session, we will go through the related exercises. Let's start. Set A, answer the following questions in brief. Question number 1, define atmosphere. Answer, the envelope of air surrounding the earth is called the atmosphere. Question number 2. Name the two most important gases in the atmosphere. Answer, nitrogen and oxygen. Question number three. Name the four layers of the atmosphere. The four layers of atmosphere are number one, troposphere, number two, stratosphere, number three, mesosphere, and number four, thermosphere. Question number four. Name the lowest and densest layer of the atmosphere. Answer. The lowest and densest layer of the atmosphere is troposphere. Question number 5. Which layer makes the radio communication possible? Answer. The ionosphere which is the part of thermosphere makes the radio communication possible. Question number 6. Which layer of atmosphere is suitable for flying jet aeroplanes? Answer. The layer of atmosphere which is suitable for flying jet aeroplanes is a stratosphere. Question number seven. What is the usefulness of nitrogen gas? Answer. Nitrogen helps in the growth of living organisms, especially the plants. Question number eight. Which layer contains most of the ozone gas of the atmosphere? Answer. Most of the ozone gas of the atmosphere is contained in the stratosphere. Question number 9. Define greenhouse effect. Answer. The greenhouse effect is the natural process by which the atmosphere traps some of the sun's energy, warming the earth enough to support life. Question number 10. Name any two greenhouse gases. Answer. Water vapor and carbon dioxide. Question number 11. The change of weather will affect the types of crops grown. Justify. Answer. It is true. In different parts of the world, the changes in the weather will affect the types of crops grown, such as wheat and rice grow better in higher temperatures, but other plants such as maize and sugarcane do not. Question number 12. Define global warming. Answer. Global warming is the temperature of earth's surface. Oceans and atmosphere going up over tens of years, which causes changes in climate patterns across the globe. Now, we will do set B. Sorry, set C. Give single terms for the following. Number one, the envelope of air surrounding the earth. It is called atmosphere. Number two, a mixture of gases. It is called air. The lowest layer of the atmosphere in which all weather changes take place. It is troposphere. See the set E. Match the following columns. Number one, troposphere. Troposphere match C, lowest layer. Stratosphere is ozone rich layer. Mesosphere, coldest layer. Thermosphere, hottest layer. Ozone layer protects us from harmful radiations. Set F. Select the correct answer and write it in the given blank. Number one, the most abundant gas in the atmosphere is. The correct answer is nitrogen. Number two, plants require dash for the process of production of food. Correct answer is carbon dioxide. Question number three. Meteors entering the Earth's atmosphere generally get burnt in dash layer. Answer is B, stratosphere. Question number four. Dash is the breath gas. Correct answer is oxygen. Now you see this diagram and complete this 
exercise. There are numbers A, B, C and D. Carefully study the given different layers of the atmosphere marked as A, B, C and D. Identify the layers and write their names on the line marked against each. Also mention one feature of each. A, A is here and you can see 80 to 100 kilometer it is uh, it lies thermosphere so write a thermosphere b troposphere c stratosphere and d thermosphere there are some features of these layers a hottest layer of the atmosphere b densest layer c ozone layer and d hottest layer that's all for today in the next session, we will do set B and set D. Now, dear student, write all the question answers in your fair note notebook and all the exercise in the book and learn. Thank you.